This is your boy Ray Ross coming at you with another dig it. Today, I'm going to introduce to you Ray Ross's Lava Style Chicken Strips. Check it out. Come on over here. See, I already took the liberty of baking my chicken strips, right? As you see, it's already red, seasoned up, ready to go. But if you want to make a successful chicken strip where it's crunchy on the outside and tender on the inside like how the motherfucking restaurants do it, follow your boy. Dig it. First thing, I got my lava sauce, right? See, that ain't going to work. Got to get messy here. See, that's that lava sauce compiled of tapatio hot sauce, habanero hot sauce, and a little bit of Tabasco and chili powder, right? Now, to make this a successful chicken strip, you already cooked it when you baked it. So all you want to do is just give it the crunch. So you fry it. And what I'm frying in is some pre-seasoned flour. Mixed with chili powder and my all-time favorite Tony's Creole season. Right? Now this is a lava stick, for real, for real. This is only for the, this ain't for the faint at heart. This here, this for motherfuckers that can handle their spices. You can't handle your spices? Man, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Stay the fuck away from these motherfuckers because they ain't no joke. Dig it. Right, while these is in here, frying, they're already cooked, so you really don't have to leave them in there too long. You just want them in there long enough to get you a crunchy exterior, right? A little quick flip, quick flip, quick flip. All you doing is bake, all you doing pretty much, just frying the motherfucking flour. That's it. All right, again, inside the lava sauce, and what makes it so thick, little bit of flour inside of the mix and you fry it up a little bit you cook the blend quick easy simple in and out right again this motherfucker is already cooked but you always want to have that nice little crunch and that tender ass centerpiece this is what you do you bake these motherfuckers for about an hour or two Make sure they tender. Again, they already cooked. So all you're doing is just putting a crunchy exterior on there so you have some tender ass chicken. See how fast that is? It should be because you spend most of the time baking these motherfuckers. <laughs> Shallow grease. You don't need that much because it ain't going to be there long. Right. Beautiful. Beautiful. Get the little pieces to it, I always shit. Quick, simple, and easy. Now, I'm bringing you a quickie because this is a good little snack. Football season's about to come around. Everybody's digging on basketball right now. You need a healthy, you need, well, fuck healthy. You need a hell of a snack. This is it. Or you can just throw it in there regular experiment, see what it does. I was curious. Got flour on it. Nah, didn't work too. Didn't work too good, so go ahead and flour it. One goddamn thing I gotta do. Get some of this shit off my hand. <laughs> In and out. In and out. I'm gonna tell you another thing these motherfuckers is good for. We all got that one drunk motherfucker, the nigga that wanna drink up all your shit. You don't got no coffee, you don't want to send him home drunk, and you damn sure don't want that motherfucker to spend a night, give him a few of these motherfuckers. 
I'd wake his ass up. Probably clean out his motherfucking sinuses too. <laughs> Again, folks, I will give you a fucking ulcer. I'll have you all fucked up. Real quick, real simple. Shout out to my boy, boy. What up, though, boy? What's up? Yeah, it's my cameraman. You know, it was brought to my attention this afternoon when I was talking to my boy, Info Joe, from the FUL podcast that uh, I forgot to give props to my mom. She's the one that showed me how to make that Bon Cheesecake. Even though I put a different twist on it, but the originality of that secret recipe came from Mom's. Love you, Mom. Kathleen Cat Walters. Rest in peace. Now, back to business. Dig it. As you can see, it's only a quick fry. In and out. In and out. All you gotta do is barely turn these little bastards over and it's done. Right? You see, I got tired of watching all these commercials with motherfuckers talking about they got spicy chicken this and, or, you know, spicy tenders that. And I taste it. Ain't shit too spicy about it. So I figured the only way to do it, make it better, is to make it better. <laughs> Nice chunky pieces, tender, and this motherfucker's gonna be tasty through and through. Y'all know what I like to do through and through. I'm just doing something that I don't like, making a fucking mess. But sometimes you gotta get your hands dirty. So you know sooner than you put the next one in, the other one's ready to come out. Plenty of lava sauce. Oops. Uh oh, I almost forgot. Moving too fast, folks. Moving too fast. In and out. I want to try to get away. I know what you're thinking. They all don't look like strips, but hey, fuck it. Same shit, right? Almost out of lava sauce. That won't be good. It's like a catastrophe. Pretty color. Look at that. Nice and gold. Drip off that grease. Turn this little fella over. There you go. See, I show you this shit early because football season is coming up soon. Not soon enough, but soon. And you're going to want something real tasty to give your folk, right? You're going to serve these motherfuckers to your boys. Again, it's a good way to sober a motherfucker up. Get that drunk son bitch out your couch. And plus your wife probably wanted his monkey ass out your house too, so I'm looking out for you. Right, there we go. Last little piece. Last little piece. In a little bit. Flip this one. There you go. See, all we want to do is just give it a little crispy coat, and that's all. It's already been cooked. I'm going to go get that little fella out the way.
Turn that off. Now, now you see me how I work that magic. Real simple. Again, this is what I did. I took some tapatio hot sauce, some habanero hot sauce, Tabasco sauce, right? A little bit of Tony's and some flour. Put it in a saucepan, throw it on flame. You mix that some bitch up. Dig it. Then you get your chicken. You season that motherfucker with chili powder. A little bit of tapatio. Throw it in the oven for a couple of hours. It's tender. That's all it takes. Boneless chicken breast. Nice and tender. Heat up your skillet. Get your lava sauce. Dip your pieces in your lava sauce, into the flour, into the skillet, into the bowl. Make sure you know what it's in your gut. Right? Dig it. This is your boy Raider Raj, serving notice. Put your motherfucking grub on. Peace.